basic GFX episode 9 and this tutorial it, this tutorial is in Photoshop and I'm going to be showing you guys how to make this kind of border effect that for like a YouTube background here let me just zoom out so yeah it's pretty simple it's use the pen tool so here we go you can come up with any kind of border I just came up with this kind of border so I'm probably just gonna do this kind of border again so I'll just do it quick so here if you want a straight line hold shift and then click the next point and then I'm just gonna make a little Okay, so here's the border. Now, I'm gonna create a new layer. And you can hit Shift Control N, or you can hit the new layer button down here. One of them, I'm not sure which one, I never use it. So, right on, now on the new layer, make sure the new layer is selected. Right click, still on the pen tool, on top of the um, border design you just created, and hit Fill Path. You can fill it with any type of thing you want, but I'm gonna do color. I'm just gonna do a dark, almost black gray. And now you can just hit the delete button to delete the pen lines. So here it is. So this is just the basic thing. But then getting it to look like three dimensional, like an actual like metallic border like this, is it's all about the bevels. So you're gonna have to play around with this. But you can I use two different layers actually. On this one I duplicated it so I could get a bottom bevel type of thing. So here you can just look at what I did for this one. These are my settings for the top layer after I do I duplicated it so this is the second one. And then you the top one that just has a bevel or this is a texture I have on my computer pretty easy to find. You can probably get it off the like brush easies or something. So here are the here's the settings embossed one of the hundred percent. Size 5, soften 0, and this is my anti aliasing. So, um, yeah, here's it if you want to copy these, but you can get your own kind of effect just by playing around with the bevel or for a while. Or if you have a preset layer style, you can try one of those. So, here's my bevel settings, texture, same texture. So, here I'm just going to use a preset actually. So, this is one of the Choir Maze presets. It gets a pretty cool effect if you do it like that. Same as all of these are, but yeah, if you had like this one, this one would look pretty nice. So yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Like, fave, and subscribe.